What's up, Aries? Welcome to Profound Effect Tarot. I'm Brandon Lippy, and right now we're doing a reading for all Aries. We're going to for Aries Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus of that sign. And I'm also going to get you an added message here from the Money Law Attraction cards. It's going to be read for your help. We're going to get right into it. Hope you all are having a great Tuesday. Exciting and eventful for all of you. Uh, well, if not, you're going to be imagining it. You have the Seven of Cups coming out here. Since this is a card about imagination, it's also a card of distraction. So it's telling you to keep focused on what it is that you want to attain. You're going to have to make a choice. You could have multiple choices you could be contemplating right now. But to stay focused on one so that you get that. And I had the Knight of Cups coming out here. With the Knight of Cups coming out, this is telling me to go after what you love. The Knight of Cups is all about romance and romantic opportunities. So you have a big romantic opportunity coming in here. And you're going to get that. And you're going to get what you want if you stay focused on it. I think you're going to be fantasizing a lot about romance. You can be fantasizing about somebody you really want to be with, going after this person. Yeah, go after him. But you got you to hold that cup. You grab that cup. You went and you took that cup. You said, that's my cup. Give me that. Give me that cup. Make sure you go after that cup. Yeah, you could have some competition here. It's telling you to be patient and to relax. See, even though you're hung up to dry in this suspended state, even though all the blood's rushing through his head, the hanged man is very relaxed in a suspended state. And you also could have changed your perspective on the situation here. I see the light around said you've been enlightened. Somebody's love has enlightened you. And it's caused you to work a lot harder. It's caused you to work a lot harder. Three of uh, Pentacles is a master craftsman. Whatever this relationship is, yeah, it caused you to... Um, Love this this love caused you to change your perspective and work a lot harder. And transition away from difficulty. I see you moving away from situations that are not certain, things you don't want with that six of swords going here. So I see you moving away, transitioning into something better here. You realize what you did want after thinking about it for a while, after fantasizing about all these different different love situations. You saw what you wanted and you went after it. You went after it, didn't you? Be patient. Do you think things are moving slow? Six of, six of uh, swords. It's, it's like the six of wands, so you're getting the victory, but it's slow movement here. Getting slow movement. Slow movement towards, towards something very stable. You can see, yeah, very stable in the, the King of uh, Pentacles. He's all about building that empire. Something that's going to last. What you invest in will grow. You have the Seven of Pentacles coming out here with Card of the Proud Farmer, which is telling you that you know you took all that time out here, put energy into something you're passionate about. Because the farmer, make no mistake about it, is very passionate about these crops here. He spent long hours, day in and day out, investing in these crops so that they will grow. And I see that it is growing for you. You know, you want it now. Look at look at the look on this farmer's face. He wants he wants that. He wants to be able to pick that fruit right now. He wants to, be able to pick that fruit right up and take it, take it, uh, take it home with him. But as you can see, there's some very slow movement. Like this, when you're both very slow movement, you are getting what you want, though. And there it is again. Yeah, stability. Also, if you're having issues with your money, I get to seek out a financial advisor. They will help you to uh, to grow your money. And to communicate. Ooh, yeah. You, you have a lot of mental clarity right now. This situation is causing a lot of mental clarity for you. It's causing you to um, be uh, quick-witted, more intelligent. The um, King of Swords is the high, most highly evolved version of the human mind. So he, he sits above the clouds, his throne sits above the clouds, he has mental clarity. 
He's very quick to judge people, very quick to cut people out that don't serve him. Yeah, and if he's dealing with heartache, he's no longer going to put up with that. This is also telling you if you're dealing with heartache to uh, to be to vo uh, verbalize this, to be vocal about it, and to cut this out. If something's breaking your heart, if something's hurting you, cut it out. You got the magician card here, so you're manifesting exactly what you want. I get that your communication is very good here. Um, the Magician is ruled by a planet Mercury, which is all about communication. So I get that you're going to be communicating in a lot of different ways. If not, you need to, and you need to be very honest as well about what you want here. You're going to get that. You're going to get that. Oh, yeah, you're going to get a lot of opportunities just flying in for you, Harry. Just coming in like wildfire with this eight of wands. Ready or not, here comes a lot of opportunities your way. Yeah, the, rate, the rate of change is speeding up for you, so keep up with the circumstances. You're manifesting some good things here. Let me get you a card here from the uh, Money and Law of Attraction deck. Alright. So the card I have for you here, Aries, is I can't tell stories of shortage and experience abundance. I can't tell stories of shortage and experience abundance. I got a message on the back right here as well. Can you read this. It says, continuing to tell stories of shortage only continues to contradict your desire for abundance. And you cannot have it both ways. You cannot focus upon unwanted and receive wanted. You cannot focus upon stories about money that make you feel uncomfortable and allow it into your experience. What makes you feel comfortable? A different story will bring different results. My thoughts are the basis for the attraction of all things that I consider to be good, which includes enough money and health for my comfort and joy. So make sure you focus on that area. And that's gonna be your reading. If it does resonate with you, make sure you hit that like button Subscribe to the channel, click on that notification bell so you don't miss your reading next week when all the signs come out. You don't want to do that. But you do want to help us grow here at Profound Effect Terra by donating. You can donate to my Cash App, my PayPal, or my Venmo. And as always, that information is going to be included in the description box below this video. So you can do all that down there. And uh, make, sure you, make sure you do, because it is appreciated. And I want to thank you all so much for tuning in. God bless you, and you all have a great evening.